All right, everybody, welcome. Welcome to Planetary Farms. Thank you so much for coming. I appreciate you being here, just wanting to learn and grow and develop as a permaculture lover, gardener, farmer, whatever you want to do, just supporter of, of permaculture. Welcome. Um, here at Planetary Farms, we specialize in varieties of different edible and medicinal plants. I've counted somewhere between 600 and 700 types of perennial edible and medicinal plants that we're growing here. So it's, uh, it's a lot to take care of, but it's a great privilege. And part of it is just really, well, all of it is just working with nature, you know, just learning to develop a relationship with nature and see how these systems work. And, Really, gardening, I just can learn everything about life in the garden. So it's just, I'm so grateful for this, this space we have here. And, uh, you know, thanks for all the blessings you guys are sending us here. We're sending you blessings. And we're cultivating this, this energy of, you know, really being connected with the planet. You know, it's, it's important, you know. There's a lot, lot um, at stake, you know, and I think. We don't want to lose these amazing varieties, you know. Um, so we're trying to preserve our varieties of fruits and vegetables and medicinal herbs and nut trees and whatever we can do, mushrooms. We got a lot growing on here, so. Um, I'll start by just going over some of the varieties we have. These are our tropical fruit trees here. So here we have a loquat, which has got kind of a tangy sort of flavor to the fruit it's it's really really nice re very refreshing um, i have one in the ground by the house that survived the winter it's a really cold hardy like seedling from oregon and uh, this one will probably have to be in the greenhouse um, other things that we have are a lot of tropical cherries so Suriname cherry barbados cherry acerola um, which is like the highest source of, I think, vitamin C, um, antioxidants, um, excellent. Uh, guavas and miracle berry right here is really exciting. So the miracle berry actually changes your taste buds to make everything taste sweeter. So you can take a bite out of a lemon, a lime, rhubarb, whatever it is, and it'll taste sweet. Um, so I plan to have that kind of like right in the greenhouse when you walk in, pick some miracle berries, and then sort of venture over to the citrus, you know what I mean? So we have lots of citrus varieties, lots of lemons, limes, oranges, mandarins, grapefruits, kumquats, even have Australian finger limes, green and red variety. Um, there's some variegated calamondin. Um, lots of really cool citrus varieties. Buddha's hand, right? So Buddha's hand is growing here. And we're really excited about that, actually. <laughs> Imagine taking the miracle berry and like nibbling on Buddha's fingers or something. <laughs> It'll taste sweeter. I made kombucha with Buddha's hand. It's just like an excellent citron. It's sort of like an ancient citrus. It's got, it literally looks like a hand and it like, it's like this, but like citrus. We grow cannabis here, like I mentioned earlier. This is our lemon kush. We grow with the lemons. And as we move through, we got avocados. Lots of different types of avocados, black, red. We got the Marcus pumpkin avocado, which literally is like this. It's like the size of, of your head, um, almost. <laughs> Star fruit is in here. Um, and then we have our mango kush, goji OG. This is our banana kush with the bananas. Uh, yeah, mangoes with the mangoes. Mango kush with the mangoes. Banana kush with the bananas. And so the plan is this is all going to be in our greenhouse. And um, yeah, 